kittens. So bear with me on this video because these are seven week old kittens and they are wild. <laughs> so kittens go through different phases as they're growing up. Between six and seven weeks, they are in a fear stage, but they are also in a very hyper phase once they're coming out of that fear stage. So these kitties and really most of my kitties don't really go through a fear stage, but um, they definitely go through this hyperactivity phase. Around eight to nine weeks, they start becoming more, uh, what's the word? I guess more specific about how they are playing instead of just running and jumping on each other. And then by 10 weeks, they're actually able to kind of stop, look around their environment, be part of their environment, just not, not just in their environment. So, um, and then by the time that they're 12 weeks, we see a definite, definite slowing down. They've gained a lot of weight. They're usually about four to five pounds at that time. And um, just overall, almost ready to go home. And then by the time they leave you guys, they're confident. They're a lot more calm. <laughs> they're not crazy. Chewing on toes like this little one's doing. Yes, you are chewing on toes. Um, and you guys get a really nice socialized kitten. So I want to get a video because next week, believe it or not, it's going so fast. Between next week and I'd say a week after that, we have to choose Callista's kittens. I have one chewing my hair and then the rest of them are just running around and playing. Let me see who's chewing my hair. I think who's chewing my hair. Oh, it's one of the Siamese. Let me, I think it's Crystal. Nope, it's Diamond. Hi, Diamond. Where are you chewing my hair? Oh my goodness, they're crazy. So I have this toy in my hand. I'm afraid to give it to them because I think they're just gonna go bananas. Hi. You wanna see this toy? You're gonna go bananas? Come get in my lap. This is winter. When you watch these videos of seven week old kittens, don't try to judge how a kitten is going to be based off of what you see in a video. At this age, very few of them are snuggly. Occasionally they'll come like step in my lap, stay there for a little while, and then they're off running and playing. And that is totally normal for seven week old kittens. Hi baby, you coming up to see me? This is the age where you use a lot of toys to get them to calm down and sit in your lap. Like this little one. This is the age where they decide, okay, well that wasn't too scary. So I don't want you to be totally convinced by these videos of what you believe about the kittens, but you can see what they look like, which is super nice. Hi. Hello. I don't have a favorite Siamese. I think all the Siamese are really sweet. I would say that Crystal tends to be the more affectionate of the, of the three, but they're all the kind of kitties that climb up on my lap and want to play and don't have any problem. They're not afraid of me, is what I'm trying to say. The little blue point balanese, somebody was asking questions about him, and he's just a real sweetie pie. I don't have any trouble with any of these kittens. It's winter right there. And of course, as they age, their colors will come in a bit darker. Lilac points, that's snow. Hey, snow. You are so pretty, snow. Yes, I know you want this toy. I know there's a big fight for the toy. Iceland. Hi. And of course, Crystal's on my lap. You can see her little paw on my finger. Hold on, girl, I gotta move. Yes, I know. Anything to get this toy. Anything at all. This is Frost. See if I can get them. <laughs> get them to come over here. Oh, 
A lot of times I have my son Brennan help me with videos so I don't have to hold the camera and he, I can just play or vice versa, but he's not available. He's, uh, he's um, getting into mountain biking <clears throat> and I'm so happy because he's 15 and he's one of those 15 year olds who's really smart, but kind of like not motivated to be outside. And all of a sudden, all of his friends decided that the only place they wanted to be was outside. And I think it's, oh, did you just bark, little guy? That was so cute. I think the only, I think the reason uh, they're like saying the only place to be is outside is because of COVID actually. So, you know, as much as we all hate COVID, there have been so many good things that have come out of being restricted and isolated. And um, that one thing for me has been my 15 year old starting to be uh, interested in mountain biking. So, but unfortunately I lose my videographers. <laughs> now I do have mom, Kalisa, she's in a carrier because I need time with the kittens without mom jumping all over everything. So you're gonna hear her meow from time to time. Did you bark again? All right, so <laughs> this is the first time I've heard him do this little bark noise. It is funny, ooh, you got it. It is a definite bark. <laughs> you're so silly. You got it. I'll let you have it because you've been wanting it so much. Here. Oh, someone else got it. This toy, I hate this toy, but oh my goodness, the cats love this toy and I don't even know where we got it from. Probably pet value when they were still in business. That's snow. Hey guys, you guys are all crazy running around. What if we just relax for a second? Play with other toys. Where are your toys? They had a million toys in here when I started this video and now I think they just run them all. I've got one climbing up my shoulder. Hi there. Anything to play with this toy. Hold on, I've got one on my shoulder. I'm gonna get off. Hi. Oh, hi. Hello there. This is not a very good video of Crystal. Crystal, hello. There you are. Come down here. There you go. Okay, so I'm going to put this toy away and we'll just let them kind of do their own thing. Unfortunately, I'm not sure where to put it. I'll put it down my shirt. Now you guys need to go play. Where's your toys, huh? Where's your toys? Did you lose your toys? Hi. Hi, baby. You're still looking for that toy, aren't you? I put it away. I did. I did. I put it away so that we don't have to play with it. Yes. We don't want to play with those things all the time. We got to get some pets. Hi there. Did you come to play with my toes? Yeah, you like my toes? I'm going to put my toes out. Here you go. There you go. Oh, I hear some toys behind me. Here's a ball for somebody. Hi, baby. I do love kittens so much. Even the ones that are full of energy. Hi, did you come back? Oh, hello, pretty girl. I know you're a little pretty girl. This is Crystal. She definitely seems to be the more snuggly. You're the more snuggly of the group. Yes, you are.
my goodness, you're so silly. I just started snapping my fingers and they have to jump at those too. Come up here. There you go. Come sit on my lap. Hi. All I'm doing is this. Look at you, Frost. You're sitting so nice. That's so nice, Frost. So don't worry, Mom. I'll be up in a second. This must be a peaceful sound because do you see them? They're all kind of relaxing. Hi, Snow. I feel like it's story time. Once upon a time, there were three little kittens named Frost, Winter, and Crystal. They lived in a big castle in the woods. They ate salmon and sardines all day long and had a huge castle to run around and play in all day. Now my hand is so tired from doing this that I have to stop. But wow, look at that. I've never done that before. And they all just kind of chill out. That's great. New technique that we can learn together. Now I'm going to get bit on the toes. Did you like that noise? Do you want me to do it again? Here. These are pretty kitties. Hi, you are so pretty. Everything about you is so pretty. I am a favorite of lilac points. And the funny thing is I really don't get very many of them. I used to get quite a few from Tiger, but she's been on the slower side this year with producing kittens. This little girl's gonna go to sleep. Nighty night. This little guy's gonna go to sleep. 